Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Jess. If you guys are not new, hey girl, hey. So first, I just want to start out by saying Happy New Year. I know it's kind of late into the year. Well, not really late, but you know what I mean. But still, Happy New Year. I hope you guys enjoyed your holidays. We're just going to get right into this video. So this video is basically going to be like a little update and telling you guys about second trimester symptoms and how it's been so far make sure you guys hit that subscribe button make sure you like this video and also leave a comment down below if you guys hear a baby in the background that's my son so i know you guys are gonna ask i did straighten my hair it was cold down here probably for like three or four days and then after that it got humid and now my hair is like a little frizzy or whatever so i am gonna put like a picture up here so you guys can see what it actually looked like when it was like straightened but yeah so this video isn't about my hair so that's that i will do an update on um my hair in another video but yeah so without further ado let's get into the video second trimester has been a lot better than my first trimester my first trimester was like super hard. I was really, really sick. Couldn't really eat anything. I just felt sick. <laughs> There's no other way to describe it. But now in my second trimester, I have a lot more energy, which I'm so grateful for because there's so much that I want to do before third trimester comes. And I know that's when like I start to get uncomfortable and, you know, run really run out of breath. Like I'm running out of breath now. <laughs> but that's when i really start to run out of breath and it's really hard to like get things done so i really want to get everything done during the second trimester <laughs> i am able to eat you know kind of whatever i want right now um still trying to eat healthy for baby but i am able to like eat <laughs> on like the first trimester where i was throwing everything up which was different for me because in my first trimester with my um, first pregnancy I wasn't really like throwing up like that so this was like so new for me but you know they say every pregnancy has like a different personality so this one was real sassy <laughs> and my belly grew a lot during this second trimester like it's so crazy um I went from anyone being like able to even tell that I was pregnant to boom like the belly just appeared and i'm going to put some pictures up here so you guys can see like how it gradually grew but i feel like in the second trimester is when your belly like does the most growing like obviously in the third trimester like you pop but like you guys will see <laughs> i'm not having like a lot of like cravings aside from <laughs> excuse me aside from pickles what else do i crave lemonade <laughs> those are like my two most cravings pickles and lemonade like i always want lemonade i'm not really able to drink any like juices babe doesn't really like juices um i try to get my smoothies in but baby doesn't like smoothies so another symptom that i have been experiencing more of is back pain oh my gosh at night i feel like a turtle when I'm trying to switch from my left side to my right side because my back is so sore and I don't know why like I don't know why but it hurts especially like when I'm sleeping at night and I don't sleep on my back because that is dangerous you guys that's dangerous so if you're pregnant do not sleep on your back if you wake up on your back it's fine but don't sleep on your back like on purpose but yeah, so I feel like a turtle in the middle of the night because I'm like, ugh. Like, <laughs> I am peeing constantly. And then at night, it's even crazier because it's like, you're trying to get a good night's sleep because everyone's like, you need to sleep, you need to get your rest, and yada, yada, yada. But I'm waking up every hour and a half to two hours to go pee. Like, I'm literally rolling out of bed every hour and a half. And it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. Especially because... You know, doctors are constantly telling you, like, you need to drink water, you need to drink water, it's good for the baby. And it's like, okay, so you want me to drink water, you want me to rest, but, like, 
make it make sense. Make it make sense. I am having round ligament pain this time around, which is pretty normal. So I'm probably gonna get like a belly band for it. I do not like having round ligament pain. Like it is uncomfortable, but I noticed that when I drink more water, I feel it less. So it could have something to do with my water intake. So I've been trying to like take in more water, take in more fluids and stuff like that. Even if it's from fruits, because I don't, I'm not even gonna lie. Like my first pregnancy, it was so easy for me to drink water, but now like water has like kind of like a weird taste to me. So, you know, I'm still trying, I'm still drinking water, but just not as much as I was the first time. And that's probably causing the round ligament pain on top of my uterus being the size of a soccer ball. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I am still spitting. I'm so over that part of pregnancy. Like, I also have to have a bottle near me. It's not as much as it was, like, in the beginning where, like, I was making so much saliva. <laughs> so, making so much saliva, like, it was ridiculous the amount of bottles I could fill in a day. But in my first pregnancy, it like kind of stopped around 16 weeks, but now I'm 24 weeks and I still have to spit sometimes. Some days it's not that much and some days it's like, yo, I need a bottle with me constantly. So I don't know when it's going to end. I guess it's different for every pregnancy and I'm just kind of, <laughs> I'm kind of over spitting like it's so gross. Um... I'm not having any nosebleeds this time, so I'm happy about that. Because in my first pregnancy, like, during the second and third trimester, I got nosebleeds a lot. So, I'm happy I'm not really having nosebleeds this time around. Um, I haven't had any, actually. So, I'm happy about that. You know, you gotta take the wins, get the losses. <laughs> the belching from my first trimester is gone. I was belching like a man. Like, literally, like, uh, 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 like, I couldn't... I was burping so much I couldn't hold it in there was nothing I could do okay like I was so gassy in the first trimester so if that happens to you it's completely normal and if you miss your period and you're like belching like a a big ass man you should probably take a test <laughs> if you guys don't know I'm having a girl this time and she's doing April and my birthday is in April so you know she might be an Aries like her mama which is crazy because my son is a Virgo like his dad and now we're having a girl and she might be an Aries like her mama I say might cuz you know babies come whenever they're ready like my son was due around my husband's birthday and like came you know a little early as you guys know so we'll see we'll see i'm not sure i don't know only god knows but we'll see yeah so if you guys want to like see the gender reveal um or any of the previous videos you guys make sure you go check that out these last two months have been i don't know super crazy when we have like a one-year-old and you're pregnant time is just like moving by so freaking fast like i don't even know how I'm already six months pregnant. I feel like I just found out. But <laughs> but yeah, time is moving by so fast and I feel like before I know it, she's gonna be here. So I'm just excited and nervous at the same time. But I'm so happy. And yeah. <laughs> so, oh, the bump update. So I'm gonna show you guys my belly. Feels so tight, it's so crazy. So this is what my belly looks like right now. Yeah, she's moving a lot right now. Um, and I love feeling her move, you know, knowing she's there. Cause like in the beginning of the pregnancy, it's like, you know you're pregnant, but one, you're not showing, and two, you can't feel the baby. You just feel really sick. <laughs> so I love feeling her, you know, move around and kick me. It's just crazy, like it's a human in there. <laughs> Anyways. I hope you guys enjoyed this little bump update, the second trimester update. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. If I did, I'll probably like comment it down in the comment section. But make sure you guys subscribe, like this video, and leave a comment down below. And thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys for being subscribed to my channel. It's been a couple years now, which is crazy. So you guys have seen my journey 
in the last couple years. You've been right there with me. <laughs> so I just want to say thank you guys for always supporting and showing love to my videos. But yeah, make sure you guys subscribe, leave a comment, like this video, and I will see you guys on the next one.